Hello everyone, welcome to our channel. In this video, I am going to explain about the jaundice. Jaundice occurs because of excessive bilirubin pigment in the blood. Normally, the lifespan of red blood cells is 120 days. After 120 days, these red blood cells die. Red blood cells contain a pigment called hemoglobin. When they die, this hemoglobin splits into heme as well as the globin and the heme gradually converts into bilirubin which enters into the liver. From the liver, it enters the gallbladder and from the gallbladder, it enters the pancreas and intestine and through the feces and urine, it expels out from the body. But in certain conditions, this bilirubin does not get out from the body and result in excessive accumulation resulting in the jaundice. There are various causes of jaundice. In conditions where there is excessive breakdown of red blood cells like hemolytic anemia, ectopic pregnancy, there are chances of jaundice. If there is any liver problem, for example, if there is hepatitis virus infection or bacterial infection, people who drink excessive alcohol or or over drug consumption like astominophen, these conditions cause damages the liver where it results in accumulation of bilirubin, finally the jaundice. And certain genetic disorders are birth defects like Gilbert syndrome, Dubin-Johnson syndrome or if at all there if there is obstruction in the gallbladder like in gallbladder stones, pancreas infection or intestinal infection or any cancer related problems there is accumulation of bilirubin causing jaundice jaundice is most commonly seen in newborns and this condition we call it as neonatal jaundice coming to the symptoms in jaundice there will be yellowish skin yellow sclera or yellow eyes dark color urine and there will be pruritus that is itching sensation abdomen swelling will be seen there will be loss of appetite, weight loss, fever, these symptoms will be seen in jaundice. Coming to the diagnosis, jaundice can be diagnosed only by the proper clinical examination and history taking and certain tests are required like liver function test, serum bilirubin test, CBP, complete blood picture where we can analyze the RBC, WBC that is white blood cells, platelets etc, urine test ultrasound abdomen scan where we can analyze the gallbladder pancreas hepatitis test and in severe conditions we can take ct or mri scan coming to the treatment of jaundice jaundice treatment depends upon the underlying cause if jaundice is caused because of excessive breakdown of red blood cells the constant treatment is required if it is because of the damage of the liver what's the reason of liver problem then the treatment is required if it is because of the gallbladder stones gallstone surgery should be done or if it is because of the viral hepatitis the antiviral drug medicines should be taken this is about the treatment of jaundice coming to the care whenever if the person has jaundice a proper rest should be needed and the person should drink lots of fluids water etc they should avoid consumption of alcohol and also they should avoid the medicines which damages the liver. This is all about the jaundice. Hope you like the video. If you like the video, please share and subscribe our channel. Thank you.